facts about the Arab-Israeli wars that you weren't taught in school. In October 1947, just before the UN vote on whether to create a Jewish and an Arab state, the head of the Arab League, Azam Pasha, when asked by a journalist, said, If the Arabs went to war against the Jews, it would be a war of extermination, a momentous massacre which will be spoken of like the Mongol massacre or the Crusades. He went on to say that the war would have three distinguishing features, faith, plunder and zealotry, and that volunteers would be coming from as far as India and China to win martyrdom for the Arab cause. Indeed, a few months later in 1948, the state of Israel was born. Almost immediately, five Arab armies and thousands of volunteers invaded the new state. The fighting was incredibly fierce, but the newly formed Israeli army emerged victorious, successfully founding the Middle East's only Jewish state and ending the first of many wars with the Arabs, like and follow for more.